Welcome to the promo video of our work titled Uncertainty Aware Pre-trained Foundation Models for Patient Risk Prediction via Gaussian Process. I'm Jiayin Lu, and this is a joint work with my amazing collaborators, Shi Fan, Wenjin, Hui, Xiao, Yuan Zhe, and Kao, from Emory University and the University of Michigan. All right. Patient risk prediction is a task to estimate the probability of a patient experiencing a health care outcome using the patient risk factor data. The patient factor data is multimodal, which includes but not, lim but not limited to textual data such as clinical notes, image data such as x-rays, waveform data such as PPG, or tablet data such as electronic health records. The risk prediction tasks, on the other hand, covers a wide range of predictive tasks. For, in for instance, it can be medical event prediction tasks such as in-hospital mortality prediction, or it can be the disease detection tasks such as atrial fibrillation detection. In summary, the patient risk prediction are crucial since they enable health care providers to proactively identify and address the potential health risks. Machine learning-based prediction models can assist care providers in timely risk, risk prediction. Recently, pre-trained foundation models have shown impressive performance in different predictive tasks with various multi-model data in both general domain and healthcare domain. Although achieving impressive performance, a notable limitation of pre-trained uh, of pre-trained foundation models is their determ deterministic predictions. In other words, classic uh, foundation models with fully connected layers lack the ability to express its predictive uncertainty. To address the above mentioned limitations, we propose Gaussian process-based foundation models. Our proposed model enables the generation of accurate predictions with instance level uncertainty quantification. Therefore, healthcare professionals can investigate uncertain predictions and make more cautious decisions. For more technical details, we encourage the audience to take a further look at our paper. Thanks.